सर्कुलेटरी सिस्टम ए सर्कुलेटरी सिस्टम इज फर्स्ट टाइम डेवलप्ड इन दिस फाइलम Yes, it is closed to circulatory system. What is closed means blood flows in the blood vessels inside the blood vessels. Hence, it is known as the closed blood vascular system. It is the well developed character. Yes, blood is red in color due to the presence of hemoglobin. Hemoglobin is present in the plasma. Hemoglobin is found in plasma. This is the invertebrate character. As usually you take the example of vertebrates. In vertebrates, hemoglobin is found in the RBC, red blood corpuscles. But here no red blood corpuscles are present in this phylum. But red, uh, blood is red in color due to the presence of hemoglobin which is dissolved in the plasma. This is also special characters when compared to other phyla. Next to reproductive system. Sexes are separate. They are mostly dioecious animals. Male and female animals are separate. Example is nereids. But some are hermaphrodites also, monoecious. Hermaphrodites. Both male and female reproductive organs are present in the same individuals. That's why they are known as the hermaphrodites or monoecious. Example is the earthworm. and leech next character reproduction reproduction is mainly takes place by sexual production of new individuals is known as the reproduction here asexual type of reproduction is also present in some in some animals that is budding is mainly sexual type of reproduction is takes place majority of the animals male and female gametes are unites and forms into zygote that is known as the sexual reproduction is cleavage is the holoblastic cleavage and spiral holoblastic and spiral cleavage is present holoblastic means complete division is takes place from anterior end to the posterior end that is known as the holoblastic cleavage and spiral and development development is direct and indirect both are present his direct development is present in uh, hermaphrodites monoecious animals for example earthworm and leech there is no larval form development is direct in some animals indirect development is also takes place indirect development means the for the presence of larva as it is present in dioecious animal example in nereids is development includes the larva that is known as the trochophore larva is trochophore larva is present in the development example is the nereids is regeneration is also present regain the last part of the body is known as the regeneration is regeneration is also present in some animals is these are the main general characters of the phylum annelida once again we have to discuss the some important characters of the phylum annelida is they are metameric segmentation body is divided into different number of segments they are externally and internally divided due to the presence of this character the phylum name is derived as annelida is yes. they are first cir circulatory system is first time developed in this phylum it is closed type and respiratory pigment is hemoglobin it is dissolved in the plasma is yes, there are different types of locomotory organs are present like ct parapodia and leech his respiratory organs also gills parapodia also helps in the respiration excretory organs are nephridia they help in osmoregulation and removal of the nitrogenous waste material is in the nervous system 
at the anterior region narrowing and nerve cord is present which is present on the ventral side of the body hence it is known as the ventral nerve cord it controls and coordinates all the activities of the body they are sexes are separate and development is includes the larva in some animals that is known as the trochophore and regeneration is present these are the main characters of the phylum annelida